Hey guys, okay, so I am at um, Buffalo Exchange here in, what is it? I think it's called The Lab here in Costa Mesa. So I'm super excited to go inside and see what they have. Buffalo Exchange has been really good to me recently and I can't wait to see what they have in the store today. Um, so yeah, let's go, the sun's out. It was really overcast earlier and cold, but now it's warm and sunny, so let's go inside. I'm excited. So let me show you guys how this place looks. It's really, really cute. Look at that. That shoe store is really popular. And here's Buffalo Exchange. They have so many cute fossil bags. This messenger is 62. So expensive though. They have this other fossil right here for 30. This is a Mark Jacobs. That's actually really nice. How much is this guy going for? Can't find the price on it. There's also this coach right here. This one's like 34. Look at you guys, I got three bags. I actually forgot four things. One of them is inside one of the bags, but I'll show you guys what I got when I get home. <laughs> I almost dropped all the bags. But let's head over to the Goodwill really quick now and see what we can find over there, then I'll show you guys the call when we get to the house. Hey guys, okay, so I'm now in front of the Goodwill. I'm really excited to go inside. This one is a Goodwill boutique. And if you guys were interested in seeing my other thrifting videos, hit the lie right there, that window will pop out. And you can select that playlist there for more thrifting videos, haul videos, handbag rehabs, and vlogs and if you would like to have it already don't forget to add me on Instagram and Facebook it's Hadrian just like it's spelled here and don't forget to check out my shop at it's Hadrian.com 10% um, of all my proceeds are still going to be going to various um, relief organizations for all of the natural disasters that have been happening in Hurricane Harvey, Irma, the fires in Montana all that stuff so um, yeah so until the end of the month of September and I think that's it so let's go inside the store and check out what they have um i got some really good stuff already at um at buffalo exchange so i'm really excited for that and i can't wait to show you guys what i got when we get home but let's go over to the store and see what they have in there all right you guys so i'm in here i found this super cute oriani 30. i found this one in gray already actually now they have one in brown there's this kelsey dagger but it's 20 dollars a little pricey and there's this fake louis vuitton this feels like handmade. It is leather though, which is cool. The interior is like a hot mess though, so I don't know about this. Probably not. And then there's this coach right here. This one is $40. And what is this guy? Francine? Who's Francine? Why is this bag so cool looking? It's really heavy. Leopard print interior. Is that a computer bag? Francine, you're fancy. Alright, you guys, let's look through the wallets. Oh, this is yellow. Looks just like the yellow Celine that I just found. Oh, and it's Jimmy Choo. Oh, this looks legit. $7.99. Perfect. Sold. Oh my gosh, how exciting. Today is such an exciting day. This is Tarnish. Let's see what other wallets they have. This is like that faux Hermes one, but it's like totally torn on the side, missing the pouch. This Dooney and Burke. This doesn't look authentic. What is this? Bimba and Lola? Oh, I know this. It's dirty though. Ralph Lauren. This little bag. Justice. This looks like a Kate Spade from far away, but when I got close up to it, it's totally not. No. All right, let's see what else we got here. Trish, Trish J, Trish. Can't pronounce it. Donna Buckman. Oh, interesting. What is this? 
the label. Good for guess. I think this is a coach, yeah. This is just like a simple coach bag. They don't have a lot of bags left. They had like a handbag sale this past weekend. So everything, all the bags were 25% off. So that's probably why they don't have any bags right now because most of the bags were purchased during the sale, which is a really good sale because it was all handbags. And I think that included the wallets too. Whoops. This one looks like a Birkin. I've been looking at this one. Lip Lane. Lip Lane. Some toy brushes, but they're really, really worn. $10. <gasps> it's Chip. He's so cute. Oh, Chip has a real chip. Right there. These are really expensive. I feel like I've seen these before somewhere else. This little thing is actually pretty cool. I wonder how much it is. Does it have a price anywhere? Look at how cute this little cow thing is. He's a little chipped though, but that's cute. All right, you guys, got this bag. Heading to the house. Oh, I got the wallet too, but I'll show you guys what hey I got. Hey guys, okay, so we're back at the house, and it's actually the same day. Usually I film these like a day or two or three later on, so we're actually back. It's still daytime, which is excellent. I like double timed it today, and it didn't go to too many stores, um, but I got some really good stuff. So. Um, the first store that we went to in this video, we went to the Buffalo Exchange store. I'm so sorry, I didn't really film inside. There were like a lot of people and it was just like really congested and I just don't like filming when there's too many people and you know, so it's just weird. So, um, but I did get some really good stuff. I got, um, a couple handbags that I'm pretty excited to share with you guys. Um, the first thing I have, oof. Okay, this is not good. It's getting stuck. Okay, let me start off with the smallest item. And I just thought this was so cute and I had 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 to get it. And it's just like a pouch, um, but it is a Kate Spade pouch. And this one was only $13, I thought it was a good price. It's in really great condition. Um, there's no like rips, tears, stains, or anything. The interior is impeccable. Um, these actually usually run pretty expensive. I wanna say maybe like 45 to $75. Um, so I was fine with the $13 price tag. I don't have any intention of really selling this. I just really like it because it's bookshelves. I love, you guys know how much I love books. I love bookshelves. I love things on bookshelves. And this one, this little pouch has like all the greats on there. There's like Moby Dick. There's Jane Eyre. Um, A Room with a View, Great Expectations, I don't even know if I'm pointing at the right one, but I'm looking at the same print on the back, so really, really cute, had to get it, $13, Kate Spade, can't beat it, that was a good, good deal, I was super excited for that, then, oh, 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 okay, there we go, the next thing I have here, now this one is a great, great crossbody bag, it's so soft, the leather is amazing, and it's like an off-white leather. This one was $46, and it is a furla. This bag is so beautiful. There we go, furla. Um, yeah, it's like literally stunning. The bag is so gorgeous. It's so clean. It's in amazing condition, and just awesome. So I really, really, really like this bag. It's a great crossbody. Um, I don't know, can you guys... You guys can't even see it, but it's a good size. Look at that. It, like, is really good. It's really nice. I like this a lot. Um, oh, and ch all these other items I'm going to be showing you guys, with the exception of the Kate Spade, it's going to be up for sale in my shop, so don't forget to check it out. It's Hadrian.com. I'm going to have that on there as well. And you guys, don't forget to add me, too, on Facebook and Instagram if you guys um, are interested in the sales. Um, I do try to post things as often as I can, but usually what happens is I set aside a special time to like be able to take photos and then post all the items all at once and then I usually do a sale video. So, <coughs> excuse me. So the way that works is um, everything that I have that's gonna go for sale, I show in the video. So even if it hasn't come up yet in a video, you'll be able to see it at least in that video. 
Um, and then I know a couple of you guys kind of get upset sometimes when you see like the item and then it's already sold. So I'm really sorry about that. But just check out these sale videos, even if you want to just like go really quick or cry, like just like um, fast forward through it and just see what each bag is. Or whenever you see the sale video, just automatically go to the shop and you can check out what I have there. So that way you don't miss out on anything. Um, so far it's like the, it's been the easiest way to work it out just because um, recently I've been getting so much handbag inventory because I, you guys have just been loving it so much. And I have had so much fun shopping and checking all that stuff out and like going to the store. So I'm just really thankful and appreciative that you guys really enjoy it and I really enjoy it too. So thank you guys so much for that. Um, so yeah. Furla, amazing. There was actually another furla bag there, but it was a little pricey. I think it was almost $200, but it was really pretty. It had this beautiful embroidery. It had like a flower, it had a flap, and it was off-white also. It was really pretty, but um, yeah, it was just too expensive. And I just thought no one would really want it at that price point. I would have to price it at, but... Um, okay, so the next item we have here is... Oh, okay, this one is a good one. I really, really, really like this bag. And it is a beautiful Michael Kors shoulder bag. Now, I don't believe that this is actually the crossbody strap that goes with it because this style doesn't come with a crossbody strap. It looks like someone just tacked it on, like the previous owner. But the bag is in fabulous condition. It's so good. Uh, it's the monogram MK in kind of like that graphite color. And then it's um, bright silver hardware. The interior is so, 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 so clean. Um, bag is just in really great shape, so this one is a keeper. It does smell a little bit like bubblegum inside, not like, like winter, like, like that winter fresh bubblegum. Like, I think it's just because someone had a piece, like a thing of gum in there, so. I don't know, it smells refreshing anyway, so. <laughs> $68 was the price that I got this bag for. Um, really, really great. You guys know that I love a good tassel, so. And I love a good drawstring bag as well. Now, the next bag I have here, this one was a really great item as well that they had in Buffalo Exchange. And every time I see these, I usually always try to pick them up. And this one is a good one because it is the Michael Kors Hamilton in black with gold hardware. I feel like this is one of Michael Kors' like most classic bags. Uh, and I just like love, I just love it. Like this... This is like his iconic bag, I feel like, one of, at least one of them, like the most iconic ones. It's this one, maybe the Selma, um, but this one was $55, leather, in great condition. It does have like a little bit of like weird like red marks on it, but I think it's just like makeup or something, so pretty sure if I just clean it off, it'll come off right away. And the interior is in great shape, no like rips or tears or anything, it's kind of hard to show you there but yeah this bag is great i love it when this bag is in this leather because it kind of gets like the slouched like looking look like i just really really like it and i think just it looks so fun and classy and then the cross body or the long strap and then um top handles the edge coating does have a little bit of cracking but it's not really too intense i'm gonna try and fill it in with some like um like uh, acrylic paint and it should be okay so, really, really cute. It has everything, the lock, the key, etc. I just didn't have a dust bag. Then after that, I went to a Goodwill Boutique, and it's one of my favorite stores as well. And what's really, really funny is that I actually found another one of these Oriani bags, which is insane. I don't know how that happened, but the same exact bag in brown. Uh, the other one I found was in like a grayish color, I don't know where it is at the moment, so I can't really show it to you, but um, that'll be up for sale in the store as well. But they're both in fabulous condition. This one is, like, amazing. Brown, gold hardware, top handle, crossbody strap. Such a nice bag. Oriani makes some beautiful handbags, and it's, like, crazy. Um, then I have this B. Mikowski bag, which is... Oh, that bag was, I believe it was $40. Um, then I have this B. Mikowski beautiful like chain detail and then two zippers on the front pocket in the back there is like a little pen mark back there i'm gonna try and get it out or remove as much of it as i can but honestly it's not even really that noticeable and it's just on the back and then yeah oh and then okay this one was 
<laughs> I had to get it. I'm pretty sure that it's like not authentic, but I've been wanting one of these for like a bazillion years. Um, but who knows? Um, and it's so stinking cute. Like I had to have it. But it is this little Louis Vuitton key like key case. I've always wanted one. This one is in the what is this called? Damier? Yeah. <laughs> the Damier print. Um, I don't know if it's authentic. I honestly have no clue. I don't know if it is. I don't think so, actually. The more I look at it, it might not be. Or it might be. Who knows? I don't know. It's just really cute. So, I mean, it says all this stuff. Anyway. It's really cute. It was only $14.99. And yeah, there you go. I can't wait to put my keys in there. It's so adorable. And then I have two more small other goods to show you. And okay, this one is so, 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 so cute. It's this little Jimmy Choo um, wallet. This one is in a bright lemon yellow. And I'm so excited for this because it matches almost like the same color as the Celine little wallet that I just found. Um, this one, though, was at a really good price. It was only $7.99, which is amazing. And it is like the little um, zipper pull is broken. Another one could easily be attached. So I'm just going to put another one on there really easily. Um, this this one, like the one inside has this one. Um, I don't know, I probably just put like a cool like little leather, like a little um, leather zipper pull on here and I'll think that, I think that'll look really cool on here. And then just clean it up because it does have a little bit of staining or marks on it, but the leather is so soft and it's so gorgeous. And so there's like the Jimmy Choo thing right there. And then made in Italy. So really, really cute. Yellow, like yellow items have just been following me around recently. Um, and I'm I'm loving it. Yellow is my favorite color, so I'm really happy and excited. And then one last item. Now this one I got at the Goodwill by my house. I didn't film there because I just like wanted to run in really quick and mom was calling me and she was like, oh, I want you to come to the house and take a look at the plants because they were like planting more plants. And she was like, I need help. So I was like, okay, well, I'm already here. I'm just gonna run inside really quick. And so I did manage to find one item and it is this YSL, like a really like cute little flat wallet. It's so adorable. It ha kind of has like a little tear thing right there, but I like it kind of just looks like a scratch. Uh, I'm gonna glue it down, and then it should be fine. And I'm gonna see what happens when I uh, condition it. But the interior is nice and clean. And yeah, so $7.99. I mean, oh, and the kids, the babies are crying. But thank you guys so, so much for hanging out with me. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. Thank you for, again, all your awesomeness and support. You guys mean the world to me. If you guys enjoyed this video, please give it a big thumbs up. Let me know in the comments below what your favorite item was that we found today. Let me know if you guys have found anything really cool recently. Don't forget to subscribe so we'll be updated every time we post a new video. And I do post videos every single day at 8 a.m. Pacific Standard Time. And don't forget to hit the little bell icon so you guys will be notified every time a video goes up. And I love you guys immensely. Please give this video a big thumbs up. It really helps. Alright, love you guys. Bye.